Hello again, everyone. We are Gaming by Gaslight, and welcome back to Starbound. So, I was feeling today, like, uh, Mr. Hylodl, would you kind of... I'd, I'd really appreciate it if you'd get out of my way. <sighs> well, what I was going to do was build a fancy pier, but apparently... This jerk won't get out of my way, so I guess that's not happening. So instead, uh, let us... How long have I had this? Unlocks the Elder Cabinet. I feel that is probably a Fracken Universe item. So I should be very careful with that, just to make sure that... Like I've said before, I, I don't want to accidentally... I want to make sure I sort of... I keep the whole... Um, Bracken Universe stuff as separate as possible from the uh, non Fracken Universe stuff, just for the purposes of making sure that I, if I ever do decide I want to drop Fracken Universe, that we can, and it won't cause too many problems. It'll probably cause some problems. That feels like it will be unavoidable. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, let us, uh, I don't know, I kind of feel like just doing a little bit of fishing today. This is probably not going to be a long episode. I, I mostly want to just kind of fiddle around and sort of play with the fishing mechanic and do some new stuff. Or just kind of relax, really, because I don't know. I, I've been feeling a little... I don't know. I wasn't really sure if I felt like recording today, I guess, is where I'm going with this. But I thought to myself, no, I, I, I really should. I mean, I can't just go a whole day without recording at this point. So, I figured I'll just do a short little episode. Just a bit of basic fishing. Because I do enjoy fishing. I also found out you can apparently pick up the, uh, the fish with the relocator. And then you can uh, sort of make your own little mini aquariums and stuff. Which seems really cool to me. Uh, I need to do something with all this food. Now I'm just going to delete some of it. Just a bit. There we go. We have a bit of rot. I'm so glad that rot now seems to count as, uh, like it's still treated as a food item, so you don't actually have to get rid of it. Pearl pea. Something spice. Whatever fishes can we get. And some of these things are actually... Like, really, really rare. I was taking a look at the wiki to try to get an idea. And that is just a jerkfish again. I don't really want the jerkfish, but I guess we'll have to take it. I mean, we don't have to take it, but I mean, it's free pixels, so why not, right? Why not, says I. It also occurs to me I really should have some kind of uh, weapon in this slot as well. I don't even know why I, I bother with these things. They're not really, They're not really all that valuable anymore. Well, there is the arguable point. Is that a never jerk? It's just a never jerk fish. I don't want any jerk fish. They're jerks. Anyway, yeah, there are some pretty rare and uncommon fish. Let's see what's lurking in the depths. Hopefully not. That looks like a fish we've already had. That also looks kind of like a fish we've already had. All right. It, well, it, it apparently wanted to get on my hook. So who am I to argue with it, right? That's what I say. It really doesn't want to come up, though. Oh, boy. Now, I was also reading a little bit more into the fishing mechanics, and it seems that only the rare and uncommon fish have a chance of actually dropping fancy items. Like lures and such. That didn't even give me any pixels. You know what? I am going to uh, put a weapon over in this slot. I'm going to get rid of these for now, because the ore and cave detector, they're not... I, I still feel those should have been... Items that were unlocked a bit earlier in the game, since by the time you unlock them, it feels like you have enough stuff in order to kind of offset any... What are you? You're just the same fish. I mean, I also went ahead and caught you. Why does it look like there's something down there? That seems kind of weird to me. Maybe I'm seeing things. Could just be my imagination. But it looks like we didn't really get anything new, so that's... 
tad bit unfortunate. There are some fish that are only available at night. There are some fish that are only available during the day. And there are some fish that are only available on different types of plant. I didn't really want you. Ah, Man. Like, some of these things seem to be really, really rare. And I'm not sure, but it feels like, from what I was reading, that the various lures don't actually seem to have that much of an effect on what you'll get. They mostly... Just, oh, here's something new. It's a box fish. There we go. But they also have different behaviors. Not all fish will actually, or Square Boy, I guess is his name. Not all fish will actually uh, just kind of swarm towards your lure. Some of them kind of stay at a distance, so yeah. Also, I didn't know at first, but you can use the left and right and up and down keys to sort of move and maneuver around a little bit. And as you can probably tell, you have to do a little bit of uh, maneuvering around. That's something we've already seen before. I'm pretty sure. That's just another jerkfish, isn't it? You can kind of tell by his jerky eyeball. Come on. And there we go. I, I still keep instinctively trying to swap around here. Alright. We should go to another planet so we can try to find some different types of fish, to be honest. I should also find a merchant so that I can sell some of my stuff. Yeah, I should recruit a janitor, because with some of the mods we're rocking, janitors are now the sort of salesman people, if that makes any sense. Or at least they're provisioners. That looks like a fish we've already got, so I'm going to try to avoid it. Oh, 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 there's something new. Oh god, come on, grab it, grab it, grab it. No, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Oh, damn it! <laughs> you stupid fish! You ruined everything! Oh well. As you can see, I mean, some of those fish, they're kinda... They really don't like to bite. Uh, you leave me alone. Dang it! I'm just gonna let go. That sounds like the guards are fighting something. I don't know. There's just something about the fishing minigame that... It's very peaceful and relaxing, especially when you're feeling... I guess just like you need to relax and unwind a little bit. Not that I've had a particularly hard day or anything, it's just... Oh my god. Bite, bite it, bite it, bite it, bite it. Yes! I have no idea what this fish is. All I know is that as soon as I saw it, I wanted it. Crescent hoop fish. We still didn't get anything cool or exciting off that. You know what, let's try to go to another planet just so we can see even more cool fish. Oh, nice. I am eventually going- wait. Who are you? No, you're not our provisioner guy. Do we have a provisioner? It doesn't look like it. Alright. I know I have some, uh... Some frozen planets around here somewhere, don't I? It also turns out, apparently, you can only fish on ocean-type planets. By which I mean Arctic, Toxic, Lava, or Magma. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, that's what we're circling, right. Blocking, fret level, lethal, right. Uh, cool stuff, crystal planet. Uh, let's see here. Any good... I wonder, also, I imagine at some point, Fracken Universe is going to update to the point where it'll had it, or add its own fish and planety stuff. But anyway, I'm gonna wait, I'll uh, cut away until we actually get down to do some fishing, and I will see you guys in a moment. Alright, so now we are on GLaDOS Waste 4 or 5000, or whatever it was. The important point here is that there are oceans of lava somewhere around here. Or at least there should be. And we're picking up random stuff lying around. Uh, this down here looks kind of like... You know what all this fishing kind of makes me think of, actually, now that I'm thinking about it? It sort of makes me think of that show River Monsters. If you haven't seen it, good show. I love that show, to be honest. Watch, that was a rare fish that I just let get away. But anyway, yeah. I don't know, there, there's something about the water that I find... I mean, I imagine most people, they find the water, it's fascinating and yet terrifying at the same time. Wouldn't you agree? 
What do we got? The soulfish. Hey, don't you dare. All right. And, yeah. What else do we got here? Let's try to stay near the surface for a bit, see what kind of unique surface fish we might find. Ooh, what is that? But yeah, I mean, there are a lot of weird things in the in the ocean. And in the river. And in every lake and stream and other, other places you can imagine, really. And I, for one... I don't know, I like it, but at the same time, it's terrifying. I mean, I get the same feelings when I'm playing Subnautica. Something is attacking me up there. Stop it. Stop it. I'm dying. Uh, listen, you jerk. I wasn't bothering you. I have a fishing license. Don't you be coming in here and trying to interrupt a good, perfectly good day of fishing. You jerk. You know, I feel like this lure sinks a lot faster in lava than it does in some other places. I don't want that fish. I, I've had that fish before. I don't want it. That's right. Go away. Go away. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Bite it, bite it. Yes, yes, yes! I don't know what you are, but you're a rare-looking fish. You're kind of like a rocket fish. That's what I'm going to call you. I don't know if that's your actual name, but I'm going to assume it is. For the time being, anyway. It is a red hand. Is it a red right hand, though? Who knows? But it's, just, it's red, and it's apparently a hand. And it's a fish. So... Make of that what you will. Alright, what else can we find? I feel I should probably... Are you kidding me? Where do you jerks keep coming from? Ah, uh, boy. I should build, like, a proper fishing shelter or something down here. Uh, anyway. But yeah, we'll, we'll wrap this up shortly. Just one more fish. That's... That's a fish we've already had. Oh, oh, yeah, come on over. Come on, baby. Bite it. Bite on my hook. Yes! Aha! Take that, you fool! You're trapped! Imperve Are you made of impervium? Oh, we got a high capacity reel. What does that do exactly? It. A uh, reel with a larger spool for a longer line. Ah, so it can go even deeper. I like it. Oh wait, I did that completely wrong. There you go. Basic lure, high capacity reel. Alright. Well, I feel this episode's gone on long enough for just showing off the fishing minigame, because I imagine not everyone is interested in watching like a full 20 minutes, and frankly, maybe I spend a bit too much time with this. But I enjoy it. Hopefully you guys enjoy just the calm, relaxing atmosphere of fishing. But next time we'll go back to doing something a little bit more proactive. I'm going to try to do some building once I feel some inspiration for that, so I'll try to make sure we have that and stuff like that. But anyway, I'm rambling, which means it's definitely time to end the episode. So until next time, thank you all for watching, everyone. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video.